Hi, I'm Fox 26 Chief Meteorologist Mike Iskovitz with a look at the tropics and a discussion of October. Are we out of the woods yet? Well, let's talk about it. This is a satellite view from October the 15th, 1989. So why am I showing you this now? Well, the question is, are we done with hurricane season? And the answer is yes and no. So when you look back at history, the latest hurricane strike that we have, at least in recorded history, let's say over the last hundred and 20 some years. Uh, the latest hurricane strike has been October the 15th, and that was a storm named Jerry that formed down in the Bay of Campeche and moved right up over Galveston Island. It was not a particularly devastating storm, but it was a hurricane and it hit in the middle of October. That's the latest one on record. And in fact, the vast, vast majority of storms um, occurred in uh, before or, uh, late uh, September, I should say. So this was uh, quite the rarity. Now the no part of this is that we have had many run ins with Pacific hurricanes. That means a hurricane that hits the west coast of Mexico moves across Texas and ends up causing some serious flooding. And those include storms like Norma in 1981, Tico in 1983, Rosa in 1994, Madeline in 1998, and you all may remember recently Patricia in 2015. That was a storm that was uh, the strongest on record in terms of low pressure and high winds. It ended up very fortunately hitting a rural area of western Mexico, moved across Texas, though, and actually caused some very serious flooding here uh, briefly in the Houston area. So what do we have going on out there right now? Well, we have Tropical Storm Julia that made landfall late Saturday as a hurricane in Nicaragua. It continues to bring the chance for very heavy rain, mudslides and so forth to Nicaragua, Honduras and El Salvador. This is the outlook taking us into Monday and eventually Monday night. It should dissipate there along the coastline around Guatemala, but uh, not before producing a lot of heavy rain. This is a 24 hour loop of the satellite, what we call the infrared enhanced satellite view from Hurricane Julia. And as it moved across Nicaragua, it has no doubt uh, caused some serious flooding there, as well as as far north as Belize and parts of southern Mexico. The rest of the Atlantic, we are definitely looking like late season mode right now with very little activity, nothing really brewing over there near the Cape Verde Islands and the uh, cloud cover that you see here over parts of the Caribbean is associated with an upper level area of low pressure, so not considered to be a threat at this time. So that's the way things are shaping up here for the ninth day of October. Of course, we'll have updates for you each day uh, here on our YouTube page, and uh, you can always keep up with everything on Fox 26 Houston.com slash tropics.